All right, all right, all right. You're on Swedes Garage YouTube channel. So when it comes to the <coughs> cooling fan on the radiator, this is what I got so far. If I wanted to use the factory fan, electric fan, I mean, this one, this fan is uh, constructed to pull air through a inner cooler and evaporator for the AC and the radiator. So it's got some, it's got some flow. This fan. <coughs> It's got some serious flow, and it's also a two-speed fan. So I jerry-rigged this fan, and I'm telling you, this is a two-speed fan. There is no electric fan in the world, I mean aftermarket, electric fan in the world, that can, that can give you the CFM from the, like this fan. I'm going to show you. So this is the this is the low speed. So let's do the high speed. Telling you guys, that's some serious sucking power through the radiator. Oh, I'm so torn about this. If I use this fan, I know it's gonna deliver a lot of airflow, not only to cool the engine coolant, but also blowing all this air on the block and the intake manifold. And you know, the colder the intake air, the more power you get. So, I, I really, I wish I could use this, but I'm not sure. That's why I need you guys, you guys input. But, I don't really like it. I had to cut down the shroud so much. It's, to get the, the factory, the 850 fan, to fit in the, under the hood. Uh, considering the engine and motor mounts and stuff, I had to cut it down, the shroud, like this. This is a lot. You can see the difference here in height. And it's the same all the way around. So, and like this, it's not this is so low so this is it's not gonna suck any air on this side of the radiator that's what I'm mostly concerned about it doesn't really need it I mean the the hot water is coming let's see now the thermostat opens yeah the hot water is coming in here, so it doesn't get cooled anything until it gets in the end. I kind of wanted the, the fan to start cooling the, the radiator in the beginning where the water comes in, or the coolant comes in, and it starts cooling right away, not after it comes about halfway through the radiator. So. <sighs> So should I use, should I use this combo? This I gotta do some custom mounting things too, because uh, you can't mount it in the factory locations. So I gotta do some custom mounting. 
and I mean if the fan breaks down it's the fan is extend is replaceable you don't have to replace the, the shroud you can replace just the fan but you still if I need to replace the fan if I'm lucky uh, I can just replace the motor and I can keep the the mounting ring but so anyway I need some input on this so I use the the factory the OEM fan that's really close to the radiator now not much of a fan shroud uh, it's got to have some custom mounting brackets somehow or see if I take this away <coughs> Should I do two small ones? See the small ones that you get when the <coughs> hot coolant comes in there, you get the, the small one, starts cooling it right away. And as it flows, two of them. Or these are two small electric fans. Or should I just put one big electric fan in the middle I've been I've been Google and reading about fans uh, for hours and hours about electric fans and if you depending on what fan you, you're gonna use uh, in some cases one big fan, one 16 inch fan, flow more air than two 12 inches. So, but you pick another brand, uh, the two 12 inches flow more air than the 16 inch. So it depends what, what brand <coughs> the manufacturer of the electric fan you choose to. But I can. I mean, you can control the 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 airflow, the CFM. You can control that by choosing different manufacturers of the fan. But I would like some input if I should go with the the factory one that I know is going to pull some air through the radiator. Or do I go with two small ones or one big one? I mean, aftermarket electric fans. Two small ones or one big one. And you have no shroud on those. So, I need some input on this. Some of you guys maybe have some experience in this, or you know someone that have tried different uh, options, they tried single one, they tried dual ones and so if you give me some input I really appreciate it. Thanks for watching, bye bye. Alright, 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 end of the video. The only thing left is to subscribe and hit that like button. Welcome back, see you in the next video.